Today we are celebrating a groundbreaking which is launching phase two to include four new transit stations and two new exchanges. Once it's completed by next summer, residents will enjoy 30 kilometers of service between West Kelowna and UBCO. I'm so excited to be here today at, a, at a, an announcement that's all about the expansion of the rapid bus project here, uh, linking uh, the, the communities of uh, West Kelowna, West Bank and, and uh, Kelowna. Uh, you know, this, this project built upon uh, previous investments that the government has announced that at the end of the day is going to result in a 30 kilometer uh, rapid bus service, uh, again, linking West Kelowna right through uh, out to uh, UBC Okanagan. These projects are expensive, there's no doubt about it. it requires a, a, a sizable capital investment, this one over $40 million. And without the support of uh, federal, provincial and local governments, it just can't happen. There's not one level of government that can fund these projects. And it's absolutely vital that we get the buy-in and support and the leadership from uh, the three levels of government to do these types of projects. $24 million from the province. We've worked hard to make sure that this happens. Federal government's helped as well. But you know, this, these things you don't do it without partnerships. And you know, as Mayor Doug Finlater said today, this could be the beginning or the next step in a much larger transit uh, plan for the central Okanagan. But this is an absolutely key piece of that puzzle. I'm glad we're getting it done.